I saw Emily in a bike helmet. I did. I finally <laughs> right? got out for a ride. Yes. This nice. weekend. It was gorgeous mm -hmm. yesterday. We got our girl out on the bike too. And yeah, I'm ready for this weather. Oh, I think we, all, we all are. It's like breathing life back into us, right? So yesterday was actually our first 80 degree day of the year so far. And today we're not going to hit 80, but we again made it well into the 70s. Lots of sunshine, satellite and radar. Again, things are nice and dry for us right now. But that is going to change in a pretty big way as we look toward your Tuesday. So future cast rolling us throughout this evening. Really no issues here. Temperatures, though, they are going to be dropping rather quickly. I think by 9 p.m. most areas by this point already in the 50s. And then eventually we'll find our low temperatures tonight in the upper 40s to near 50 degrees. Now I have the clock stopped at 7 a.m. tomorrow morning. We're already seeing our first wave of showers. A couple rumbles of thunder going to be possible in the morning. But I'm not overly concerned about any strong or severe storms during the morning, the midday hours. The storms that I'm much more concerned about, they're going to be here during the evening. So future cast showing that by 6 p.m. or so, we'll have a couple showers and storms around. But watch what happens later in the evening. So by 9, 10, 11 p.m., we're likely going to have a strong line of storms moving through. And all hazards, unfortunately, are going to be possible. That's damaging wind gusts, hail, and maybe even a couple tornadoes going to be possible. So make sure you have ways to get those severe weather alerts. Again, this is for tomorrow evening into the early morning hours of Wednesday. I have the clock stepped here around 1. 2 a.m. Finally, by that point, we're beginning to get a break, but then another wave of storms going to be possible on Wednesday. For tonight, 49 degrees will be partly cloudy. Your seven day forecast tomorrow, very stormy. Again, severe storms are possible Tuesday evening. On Wednesday, in the morning and midday hours, we could potentially be dealing with an additional round of stronger severe storms, especially over in northwest Indiana. Thursday, drying things out. Friday, Saturday, and Sunday looking good. Just much cooler again. We're in the 50s this weekend. Back to you. All right.